And a lot of people who were in Detroit for the filming of Sparkle really do believe that Whitney's performance just may earn her an Oscar nomination next year. Really? We'll have to see, but uh, apparently she is fantastic in this movie. Very insightful, Eric. Yeah, yeah. Great job. And speaking Thanks. of Oscars, we've got to address the fashion now because I've been waiting the entire show for this. Here we go. You saw the stunners on the red carpet, but what about all the couture at the after parties? Marie Claire, Zana Roberts Rossi, who has styled Jennifer Aniston, Drew Barrymore, and Naomi Watts, is here to break it all down for us. Hi, Zana. Hello. Here's what I want I need to understand. Why would someone <laughs> find the perfect dress and then change when they go to a party? These girls are media savvy. They know the more they wear, the more column inches they're gonna fill. So who stood out to you? J-Lo, Emma Stone, Cameron Diaz, all three of them were super quick change artists. Zuhair Murad, same designer as this, uh, this afternoon. What was the backstory on J-Lo and her dresses up dresses. on the evening? It was definitely plural. The first dress she wore, she'd actually requested a sketch. So she received that six weeks ago. And then the second dress by the same designer also was requested, but it was straight off the runway. I know there were a lot of beautiful women, but someone that I haven't heard anybody talking about is Georgina Chapman, the co-founder of Marquesa, and also their top designer, Harvey Weinstein's wife. She, in my opinion, looked elegant, beautiful. I mean, she was incredible on the carpet. She was one of my favorites. Exquisite. And we talked to her, actually, on the yeah. red carpet about her own stunning dress and also who else she was styling. Listen to this. And who did you work with for today's Oscars? Well, I have Stacey Keebler, and I have my fingers crossed, and maybe there's one more coming. And it's a big one, I can tell you that. <laughs> And of course, now we know who that big star was. Sandra Bullock. She looked incredible. And that gown, the thread on it was 24 karat gold thread. Really? Costing tens of thousands. Well, this is a big business for designers. It's millions. To have a look on that red carpet is worth millions in advertising. The girls are out there because advertisers are looking at who's going to be the faces of their next campaign. They've got to really impress. All eyes are on this event, and there's millions to be earned, and millions are spent. What happens when somebody wears a dress that someone else has worn before? Uh-oh. Kourtney <laughs> Kardashian oh. wore a dress that Viola Davis wore, correct? Absolutely. Usually you will be vilified for something like that. Our thanks to Marie-Claire Zana Roberts-Rossi. Always good to see you. Thanks. Thank you so much. Great stuff.